And Nimmo later is going to get back in that elf uh, outfit and go back up to the North Pole to, to help Santa. But anyway, uh, notable free, free agent red signings. Uh, eight years, $162 million are for Nimmo, but Justin Verlander, two years, and he's got a vesting option for a third year at 35 mil. Kodai Senga, well, we'll get to see him pitching that Mets rotation. Jose Quintana, David Robertson as well. So, Dan, you talked about earlier in the show, man, the Mets have spent a ton of money. Will they spend more? I think they will if an opportunity comes along. I'd still like to see the club add a little bit more power. Um, Adam Duvall I'm a fan of. I think he can play all three outfield positions. He can DH for you. And he can hit the ball to the ballpark if given the opportunity and the at-bats to do that. So I still think there's more work to be done. What about you, Jay? Yeah, I think so, too. I like this new signing. You had to get this done. He impacts the ball on, on both sides of the ball. He's a, a really good player. He's been a Met for a long time, and, and that was special to hear him talk about what it meant to be drafted, developed by the Mets, and I love to see a player – Stay true to that and stay and not run after the biggest deal. You hear him talk about wanting to win in New York. You see the effort that Mr. Cohen and, and the rest of that staff is doing. I'd like to see him add a left-handed arm in that bullpen. Okay. We all see, and you said it earlier in the show, if you want to build a team that's ready to win the World Series and compete now, bullpen, bullpen, bullpen. We saw the difference Diaz made. Adovino and Lugo are out there, but we've got Robertson. You add a left-hander in there that's a really big name, you really solidify and look like a, a team to build off the second You know, I, I'm really excited about three of their young players, too. I know they didn't get many at-bats last year in Beatty, Vientos, and their young catcher. I hope they introduce some of those young guys into their lineup this year at some point in time and bring them along, too. Because there's, they're, like the Beatty kid, is he's a tremendous hitter. He's an incredible athlete. Okay. He's just got to get comfortable playing third okay. base. There's huge upside with him. So, anyway... I am excited about their future. And if you're a Met fan, I mean, look, you have to applaud. I mean, your owner and, and management in the front, they're doing everything they can to put uh, the best team on the, on the field, see if they can win a World Series.